One day after being arrested on first degree murder charges following the shooting death of a 14 year old, Ashantia Dillard was in court. Thank you for joining us. I'm April Thompson. I'm Alex Coleman. WREG's Marcus Hunter was there as her lawyer said all she did was point at the victim. After being read the possible penalties if convicted of first degree murder, Ashanti Dillard was in tears. That charge carries life without parole, life with the possibility of parole or the death penalty. According to police, Dillard arrived at the residence at Village Green Apartments Saturday evening with eight others. They say video shows her walking to the pool area and pointing at a man in the water, accusing him of assaulting one of her family members. The affidavit indicates that she pointed at the individual and then somebody else with an assault rifle uh, shot that person multiple times. A teenager died. Two others were hit and taken to the hospital. Her court appointed lawyer telling me when he looked at the affidavit, the thing that stood out is that Dillard is not accused of firing any shots. Right now, you know, she's she's the only one that's arrested on this and, and they're not accusing her of firing a single shot. I don't know what else they've got that would connect her to this. Assistant DA Chris LaRoe says that falls under what is called criminal responsibility, which states a person is criminally responsible for the commission of a felony if they know someone else is going to commit a crime and provide substantial assistance for the act to be carried out. Prosecutors also hope other witnesses come forward. There is some video surveillance that may have captured some of this incident, but eyewitnesses to any crime are always of utmost important and importance, and we're hoping that they will all be cooperative with us. Ballinger says pointing is not a crime. She told the police that she pointed at someone. That is not admitting to any sort of uh, intent for anyone to be shot. Dillard is being charged with criminal attempt first degree murder, first degree murder, and aggravated assault. In Memphis, Marcus Hunter, WREG News Channel 3. Now, police are still searching for the accused gunman. If you have any information that can help, call Crime Stoppers at 528 Cash.